finish all the crochet. So uh, we start to sewing this side seam together. So this is the back part, um, back piece, and this is the front, and this is the right side. So we need to make the right side face to face. Face to face. So this is the wrong side. We sewing from the wrong side. So at this moment, you can find that um, the the piece, the back piece, is on the bottom, and the front piece is on the top. So we first, when we pick up, and um, this side we start from a chain. So here you can easily find the stitch. Here, very easy to find the stitch. We do not pick up only one loop. We just pick up the whole stitch. Can find here is the first stitch, the second stitch. So insert to the first uh, hole. And then the bottom piece, we will pick up the uh, back loop only. So this is the whole stitch and this is back loop. The first stitch, we just just pull this here. Then the second, this is the second whole stitch. This is back loop only. And then pull the yarn over. Okay, whole stitch, back loop only. So you just do like this to sew in the seam and you just count the stitches according to the pattern. Uh, now for my size, uh, this is the last uh, stitch to sew. And uh, after um, sew this, you can just cut the yarn or you can leave the yarn here uh, when you do the, to do the sleeve. It all depends. So here you can see the seam. It, it, it looks nice. You even cannot find where the seam is. So this is the right side. And then next step is to make the collar. Now we start and uh, do the make the collar. The collar we first we from the um, this the left side of the collars, and uh, we come to the stitch, the connect connect stitch here, to take it in, and then we do seven stitches. seven stitches and then one chain this doesn't count as any stitch and we do slip stitch for seven stitches one two three four five six so when do the, the seven stitches we just connect with the first stitch of this here. And then we do a slip stitch to the next stitch. And then turn. And then we do the slip stitch, seven slip stitches. And one chain and then turn and do another seven. One, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven. The last stitch we crochet together with the last with the next stitch. Yeah. And then here we here for my size here has four stitches. So now I already used the three. So this is the last one. And then turn and here has seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and the ten. And here we already used the four stitches here. So next the stitch we will use this stitch here. Use this stitch. We use this stitch. Actually is for this round, right? Each round we have one stitch. And here we have three uh, we have four. Then we have four stitches. So it is easy to find that. Okay, last stitch, we just go this way. And then next, I need to here, one, two, three, four, this stitch, make a slip stitch, then turn. And then seven slip. So the whole color is just to just like this way. Okay. So then when we go back, the last stitch I need to crochet together with the next stitch of the of the collar with this so this last stitch come to next stitch crochet together and then a slip stitch to next and then turn so this is the first stitch uh, if you um, I think it is hard to find the first stitch and then just put a marker when you finish the first stitch and this will help you a lot. So I just do like this and, the, and here then I the next stitch and before I move to here I need to make a stitch here. And here has two stitches and then I need to have a stitch here and with this part each row is one stitch so one stitch come here to last stitch to crochet together with one stitch then have a slip to next stitch as a stand up stitch just to do like this way uh, now I almost I finished uh, all the uh, the colors and uh, here is the last uh, row. Then I need to sew these two parts together. So after I finished the last row, first we just uh, um, put this let the right side face to face, and then we we found that it's the here we start with a chain so we just 
find the whole stitch and pull pull this stitch here and the next here we just pick up the next stitch and this part we just we just the bottom part we just pick up the back loop only two here and one stitch by one stitch We just pick up the back loop only and one stitch by one stitch here we have finished and cut the yarn and you can find this and um, here it's on the left shoulder so the collar is finished next I will show you how to make the sleeve 